What's up, people? This is William Jones. The purpose of these videos is to make you think. Turn your minds on and begin to think. So the whole purpose is all about leaving religion and whatnot. So for this video, I might do something a little different. I want to address something. And that's trolls. You know, when, you, when you're doing stuff and, and, and opening up and talking to people, and you have some people that disagree with you, you have trolls. They just follow you around, want to say stuff. Every time you post something, every time you make a video, they got something negative to say. They're going to always say the opposite of what you say. Because I, so I got a, a couple of trolls on my Facebook page. When I was teaching the Bible, they were Christian trolls. So, of course, when I left, they were just worse. You know, all the, oh, you was never saved in the first place. You never knew God. You never had the Holy Spirit. You know all that foolishness they say. So even on YouTube, I can't say I, I got a lot of trolls. I notice I have one. And I'm not going to say the person's name. But if you go to my video, Leaving Religion, Christianity, and its foolish responses, you'll see them there. And I mean, with the title that they have for their name, but the way that they spoke, and it's a Christian too, the way they spoke so harshly, you know, want to call me stupid, call me a simpleton, you know, uh, not, and not leaving comments, but leaving like, like parts of a book, I guess they didn't release or whatever, you know. That's not a comment when I got to go, uh, come on man, three minutes later I'm still reading, that's just too long. I can't, I'm sorry, I can't read the super long comments. But anyway, the guy kept harassing me, whatever. So I said, okay, let me check his page. I check his page out. It just so happens he does videos. I'm like, okay, let me check out some of the videos. I look at the videos, you know, the titles or whatever, you know, basic Christian stuff. So I click on the one talking about Good Friday. Because this is right before Easter. Because today is what? Uh, April 23rd, 2017. It's a Sunday. The day all the Christians just got back from worshiping the, the sun. S-U-N. Thinking it's the S-O-N. But anyway, he was talking about Good Friday. And how, you know, there's no way Christ could have been uh, crucified on a Friday and resurrected on a Sunday. Which, I mean, that's, I used to teach all that same mess. Christians don't care. I mean, you know, if, if he was alive, he was crucified on a Wednesday, rose uh, Saturday morning. Whatever. Saturday afternoon, I think it is. But whatever, it didn't matter. Anyway, so, I, you know, I suffered through that video. And then I clicked on another video. And it's funny, even in one video, I, you know, he spoke harshly with me, but was telling people they need to watch their anger management. I'm like, wow, this is kind of hypocritical. And, I mean, the videos, I mean, it was like watching paint dry. It was, they were... I don't want to. I don't want to say boring. They they were non-exciting. That's what they were. They were non-exciting. I don't want to talk down on the brother. You know what I'm saying? But um, come on, trolls. I mean, come on. I mean, I'm not. I'm not gonna do all this research to to suck myself back into religion. It's pretty much nothing you can say to get me back in religion. For real. And if God got anything to say to me, he knows everything, so he knows where I am. He, oh, God's going to speak to you. He had 22 years to speak. You know what I'm saying? Other than reading the Bible, you ain't really talking. So he could have said it then, he ain't said it then, he ain't said it from then to now, and I'm fine. Life is fine, okay? But to my trolls out there, I guess you can keep on trolling. I guess that's what you do best. But it's just, it's just amazing when you watch a Christian troll talk about being Christ-like and all of this, but all they do is slander you and call your names and talk talk bad about you, you know? Y'all are loosen up, man. Like once you got out of religion, you realize it's just not that serious. When you get out of religion, you look back like it's just not that serious. You don't really care what other people believe. You're not in Walmart saying, where's the Christian cashier? You're not a bit that Burger King or something. I only want a Christian to serve me. I only want a Christian to cook my food. You don't go to the restaurant and worry about who in the kitchen cooking. It, it, once you get out of it, you realize none of it really matters. It doesn't matter what someone believes until you start imposing your beliefs on other folks and knocking on their doors and worrying them and, and condemning them to hell and whatever else because they don't believe what you believe. Come on, y'all got to grow up, man. It's time to grow up. Get out of these fairy tales. Peace.